Hello there, and good evening. I'm Steve Eager. First on Fox 4 News at 5.30 tonight, some pretty bold crooks are using a new tactic. They are robbing people in their front yards. Seven attacks have been reported in the last 10 days. These attacks and ripoffs have happened at homes in the southwest Dallas County area. Fox 4's Melissa Cutler talked to one of the victims today. She's at Dallas Police Headquarters tonight. Melissa. Well, Steve, you know, these attacks have occurred between last Tuesday of last week and Sunday. Dallas police believe they're all connected and involve the same suspects. Came across their driveway. 77-year-old Robert Jenkins is still jittery since last Tuesday when he was jumped. And I didn't even see him approaching. It didn't happen at night, nor in a public place, but in his own driveway in broad daylight getting out of his car. A man in a hoodie tackled him blindside. I think he was doing this to me, maybe with one hand, and then I don't know how much is. I think he kicked me while I was down. The suspect had a gun. I just remember him standing in that position, pointing the gun right in my face, close range. He just asked for cash. I had my wallet in, in my pocket, but I'm glad he didn't. You know, he just asked for, he said, give me your money. How much did the guy get? Is that no, at least 250 A neighbor across the street tried to help. And he put a gun on him and made him stand back in the yard behind me. Jenkins says the thief had some help from an accomplice in a brown or blue beat-up old Crown Victoria with front-end damage. He says police dusted his car for fingerprints. He hopes they find a match. No one was hurt in any of the seven instances. Dallas police said they just want this alert to go out so that people are extra careful even in front of their own home. Steve. Melissa Keller, DPD headquarters, thank you.